Hello there. How are you doing this morning, evening, afternoon? Uh, welcome to Meadows Diaries. Kama kawaida, I have amazing stuff coming up to you. How are you? How are you doing this morning, evening, and afternoon? Before you go a bit further, welcome to the Containers World, the place of peace. Yes, and uh, on today's uh, Words of Wisdom Day, ah, let's go in and we talk more about it. Hello guys, how are you doing? So today we are in for a big one. <laughs> and uh, before we go further, like I said earlier, and today's, uh, where is my phone? And today's was the wisdom Tangles comes from the book of Psalms, chapter 1, 2, verse 3. In the message translation version, and it says, The word of God is a seed of stability for the saints. Various faces of destiny. God's word is to be patiently seeded in your heart for glorious now and future. I repeat again and say the word of God is a seed of stability for the faith. Various faces of destiny. God's word is to be patiently seeded in your heart for glorious now and future. Yes, those words were said by our known man of God, Pastor Joseph Fire. <laughs> and uh, today, even though I am so excited, today, today, guess what, guys? Today, today is that day. Leon Ile Siku. Leon Ile Siku. So today we are having our church Kesha. And uh, today is on 19th. Friday, yes. So we are having our church kitchen starts from 10:30 p.m. and ends at 4 a.m. Kama kawaida, I came early. <laughs> so yes, there's a few things that I need to do, and uh, the kitchen will be, or our church, or rather our church is at a Miracles Dorm behind Sheraton College. Yes, along Committee Road. Yes, don't mind the the noise back there. There's something being done, and yeah. Welcome, let's have a hand together. Let's enjoy. And uh, so today, I am going to take you through the service. And I uh, hope you guys are blessed as I am, as we fellowship together. And uh, let's have fun, let's enjoy, let's rejoice together. Let's be blessed. Kama kawaida, who says those words? <laughs> and um, let's get to experience God um, in a different way perspective of life and everything let's come open let's come hungry for god and uh yeah so come up i will summarize the um the service uh into portions and uh hope you like it so see you then i'm going to inform you when people start coming up i'm when time is time time reaches for people to come i am gonna inform you guys and we shall have fun together so yes Karibu sana, the Gonzalez world, a place of peace, and uh, let's get to enjoy, learn, hear God, yes, and have a different experience. I'll see you. Ciao.
high five someone and tell them welcome to the night of establishment. Ah, it's the night of establishment. <laughs> the Lord is doing us good. Even Satan knows it. High five another one. Tell them welcome to the night of establishment. Yeah. 
establishment welcome welcome to the night of establishment high five another one and tell them welcome to the night of establishment high five another one tell them welcome to the night of establishment yes tell them we are reconcilers Oh, 
Cité, à ma cité, il donne à il, la guise, I am the girl, oh, I am rich, I am prosperous, oh, I am blessed, I'm the son of the earth, 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 I carry the flavor of God. On the earth, I'm the son of the earth. Oh, I'm the son of the earth. I'm the son of the earth. I carry the flavor of oh God upon the earth. I'm a city, city, I'm a city. Surely there is no enchantment against me, no divination against me. I am covered. I live to dominate, to dominate. Surely there is no enchantment against me, no divination against me. I am covered. I live to dominate. Surely there is no enchantment against me, and no divination against me. I am covered. I'm highly favored. I'm favored. I'm favored. I'm favored. I'm favored in Jesus.
fire, we on fire, we on fire. Nothing can stop us, nothing can stop us. They cannot stand us, they cannot stand us. We on fire, we on fire, we on fire. Nothing can stop us, nothing can stop us. They cannot stand us, they cannot stand us. We on fire, we on fire. No limitation, we take it over. We getting bigger every day. We are getting bigger every day. Bigger every day. We getting bigger every day. Bigger every day. No limitation, we take it over. We getting bigger every day. We are getting bigger every day. Bigger every day. We getting bigger every day. No limitation, we take it over, we get in bigger every day. We are getting bigger every day, bigger every day, we get in bigger every day, bigger every day. No limitation, we take it over, we get in bigger every day. No condition remains, no situation remains, no health challenge remains. Total healing, total health, complete perfection of health. Les Saliba, Rondolobo Sai, Makwabakai Kayoko Tolobaya, a marvel that you may prosper. Be in health, even as you are so prosperous. Makayatoa, Yabalia, Dolobo, Sererekai, Taliana. Shabakari andere kasa, lemba swambe la katale atoi bara, la gabi zavele katoane barinda baradi sovana, pa kapale sepana, lebe seba kari rado satane, rokobo sokobo rokoto koto bai. Le Quebec est sur le Catane. La gaie est posée, gué, 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 Shababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababababab
Rabakande Kosai. I love raising this atmosphere. The love of God is strong in this atmosphere. That our hearts may be enwrapped in that love. Quando coso cobaradia Le che sulla binda rinda li assai Menande le che se le mandiria santo la Akabi kopolo sambedai Libando arua swambe lekete lekete yasaya Liga suvalai Shabaradi Kaya Mandagia Subai For your name is holy. For your name is holy. Liba so baladia sai.
And tonight that name is available. Tonight we are gathered in that wonderful name. Tonight we are converging that wonderful name. Legesia Lukata. Establishment. Yeah, I'm telling you. And the Lord is up to something good. Amen. Amen. <laughs> good. Romans chapter 1, verse 11. Quickly, sir. Romans 1 11. I long to see you that I may impart to you <laughs> some spiritual gift. And the effect of the gift will be that you'll be. Come on. After you are imparted with some spiritual gift tonight, what will happen is that you'll be established in a very new way. Amen. Now, I want to do something. It's been amazing since I did this. I want to release some spiritual gift. Is that fine? If we carry it forward, I use that. This is not the time for the mic to miss me. So, so we want uh, we want to release some uh, spiritual gifts, and uh, to that end, every one of us will be established. Amen. Amen. I'm telling you. Let me read you something, then we'll go back here. I show you something. Chapter two of Hebrews, verse number one, two, three, four. Start with NKJV, then I'll tell you to switch. 
it is therefore we must give the more earnest heed uh -huh, to the things which we have heard lest we drift away verse number two he says for if the word spoken through the angels proved steadfast and every transgression and disobedience received a just reward verse 3 verse 3 says how shall we escape if we neglect watch what he calls it so great salvation which at the first began to be spoken by the lord and was confirmed to us by those who had it verse number four this is how it was confirmed god also bearing witness watch this both with signs wonders and with various the word there is diverse diverse miracles and watch this one and so when god begins to confirm the gospel mm -hmm. brothers and sisters if our message lacks signs wonders diverse miracles and gifts of the holy ghost we are like islam our christianity without sights without wonders without diverse various miracles and without expressions and manifestation of the gift of the holy spirit it's any other form of religion it looks like good mongiki good kamjesh when it lacks this. So for our gospel to be complete, it must have this fold. There must be signs and wonder. There must be various miracles. And Frank, there must be gifts of the Holy Spirit that are in distribution as the Lord wills. Now, I want to take verse number three and four. I first take it in message. Then I read you one more verse. We try and go back to Romans chapter 1, then we make a prayer. Amen. Yes, he says. He says, Do you think we can risk neglecting the what? Kasuba Balikese Bana. Let me tell you what I said in tongues. I said in tongues that the message of Christ still remains to be the latest message in town. You know, it's amazing. And KJV calls it so great salvation. Then I love this one is the latest message you see the reason we are here is because we must be relevant for jesus and for us to be relevant we must have something that is relevant then he says we don't have to compromise the gospel but there is something that can hit us there is something that can be imparted in us and that thing makes us relevant we don't have to tell people there is no jesus and we don't have to try to cover jesus but something can settle in us and on us and begin to work in and through us. He calls it the latest message, sir. Ah, this is good. This is good. Watch it. He says, the latest message, then he says, this what? This magnificent salvation. He says, first of all, it was delivered in person by the Master Jesus, then accurately passed on to us by those who had it from him. Verse number four. Verse number four says what? All the while. Come on. God was. This is what you begin to do when you share Jesus. You didn't hear what I said. I'm telling you from tonight. or oh, it's morning. From morning when you talk about Jesus. There will be proofs. Anyone can open the scripture. And anyone can say I had word. But there has to be spiritual validation. The Lord has to place his hand on it. No one can pray for now. But there is one who has validation of their prayer. People who fear us when we pray. I'm telling you, when we tell people who pray, they will beg us not to pray. Some of you don't believe. Just keep watching. Let me speak for myself. When I tell people, let me pray, they will get more scared. They fear. Now they will be more scared. Because of validations. You see, God wants to validate our working in the marketplace. We yeah. must begin to understand that one. There are where God has planted us in what they call secular spaces. God wants to validate. God wants to prove he is with us. Yeah. You know, 
when, uh, when the angel of the Lord appeared to Gideon in chapter 6 of Judges, Gideon was a wise man. Let me first take this one, then I'll go. You remind me, Judges 6. Then we, we pray. He says, validating it with gifts through the Holy Spirit. And he says, all this, all sorts of signs and miracles as he saw fit. Now, I pray that every one of us now can open their spirit. You see, why all sorts of miracles is good? Some of us need results that cannot be explained in our offices. You need to surpass targets in a strange way. We are talking of establishment. We are to be established in Christ. But we cannot be established carnally. There has to be something spiritual. He says all sorts of signs and miracles. Meaning when they went to do business. As others came back with a thousand. These ones did a million. That, that's, that's a sign. I want you to see it beyond preaching. So meaning for Joshua when he said go. Something happened. So for those who are in offices. Something must begin to happen with their machines. Yes. Ah. We agree tonight we are giving people jobs. Yes. There are all sorts of miracles. There are all sorts of signs. There are all sorts of wonders, sir. He says through the Holy Spirit, all sorts of signs and miracles as he so fit. Go to verse number three in the passion and verse number four. Then you give me judges, then you give me Mark. We pray now. He says, then how would we reject? Would we expect to escape punishment if we despise what? The very the very truths that give us life. Then he says, the Lord himself uh -huh. was the first to announce this thing. And those who had in fact on their All right, verse number four. Then I love this one. He uh -huh. astonishing wonders. I love astonishing wonders. Uh -huh. All kinds of powerful miracles. And by the gift of the Holy Spirit. We did what? So I want to get to that place of distribution. You see, the Lord wills to distribute gifts to us tonight, Amen. this morning. Let me stand here so that I can see everyone. The Lord wills to distribute gifts to every one of us this morning. Yeah. I'm telling you, the truth is he has been distributing. My reading this is just affirming in your spirit. And as we make that prayer, you receive whatever you desire. If I, God leads me to touch one person, we just use them as a point of contact. Can we agree on yes, that sir. one? Now the Lord wills the old wheels. You see, many years ago, the Lord said to me, he said, after I agreed to preach, he said, son, I'll validate what you say. People don't understand why he speaks scriptures with boldness. Some think it's arrogance. He told me, son, anytime you talk scriptures, they will come alive in the hearts of men. He told me that, Vivian. And he also told me something in 2016 when we began. He said, son, a time is coming when I will take every grace I have given you and distribute it to people. I began saying this then. I was waiting for that time. And never before that time is here. Amen. Brothers and sisters, something is happening in our land, Kenya. Amen. Let no devil lie to you. Something is happening. Something, and this thing is happening with our generation. So you discover now what God begins to do. He begins now to make sure these things he has given some of us begins to be distributed in such meetings. So that people live here, they go to offices, and they work out mighty signs. And he said to me, the move of God will entail marketplace. That's what God has been telling me. That's why I'm allowed the marketplace. He said, sir, it will, it, there will be results in the marketplace that cannot be explained. You see, we can all go through four years course, five years course, seven years course. We can do whichever number of years. But when we introduce the Holy Ghost, it's called the Ancient of Days. So anything can be possible, sir. He can take witches for 2070 and bring it here. Then tell you now, instead of having a 2021 result, compress this 50 years. Look at your amen. He said, this is what he is saying. 
gifts, all kinds of powerful miracles, astonishing wonders, ministry with signs, and by the gifts of the Holy Spirit. Now, I'll take Judges chapter 6, verse number 12. So you make a yes in your mother, Kabisa. So now, he says, And the angel of the Lord appeared to Gideon and said to him, uh -huh, The Lord, the Lord is with you, you mighty man of valor. So did you realize the first thing that I want us to see, because the Lord will speak to us, is that uh, when the Lord appears to you, he does not refer to you by where you are. The Lord speaks to you from the place of where he is. And where he is, everything has been finished. Where he is, everything is complete. So he says to Gideon, the man is hiding. But he tells him, you are a mighty man of valor. So for some of us this morning, the Lord has been saying, and the Lord will continue to say, do not tell you you are broke. Actually, the kind of vision you have been seeing and that you begin to see, there will not be visions of how broke you are. There will be visions of you abiding in abundance. And uh, you see, if I don't show you how God speaks, you may miss how he is speaking. He's telling Gideon, the man is hiding. But he does not tell him, you coward. He tells him, you mighty. So for some of us here, God will tell you, you mighty man of God. You mighty woman of God. And the truth is you have been running from him. Okay, go to verse number 13. I'll make a prayer here. He says, Gideon said to him, Oh my Lord, if the Lord is with us, why then has all this happened to us? Uh -huh. And are which... No, hold on. Where are what? So you must discover part of what will pass to the next generation is testimonies of miracles. So we're in a time where now we we'll not just work out miracles. We we'll teach people to work out miracles. In the need of spiritual fatherhood. When I begin to tell you we will father marketplaces, when I tell you we will father nations, what we are saying is we are now, now we are moving from just working out miracles to a place where we train people. This is how. This is how we heal legs. Yes. This is how we prophesy. Yes. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. So Gideon got it. He asked, where are miracles? So this, I love this guy. Where are miracles? If God is with us, it should not be that way. So this morning, if God is with us, we cannot live here jobless. I'm saying if God is here and he is here, we cannot live without results. There comes that time as a generation we decide. We decide now, if God is here, sir, I will hear him this morning. If God is here, Lillian, I will interpret my tongues. If God is here, I will receive this gift I have been fasting for. If God is here, there has to be stability in my family. If God is here, I am receiving my graduation. Please hear me. The things of God, I'm preparing our hearts. Dimensions in God are not accessed from a place of laxity. You never receive anything from God just to pure fifa fifa. The things of God are received from a place of I want to call it that that no sound bad. But there has to be passion. Let me read you one more verse. I take you to Mark. Go back to Romans. We pray now. Thank you, Lord. Chapter chapter what, sir? Chapter 29 of Jeremiah. I start with CV verse number 11, 12, 13. And I switch to message. Thank you, Lord. He says, oh, 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 oh. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Start with 11, sir. That's good. He says, I'll bless you with a future filled with hope. Say amen. amen. Then he says, a future of success. A loud amen. amen. A future of success. Not of Already the Lord is speaking. Remember I have told you, stop looking at your pocket. Let your neighbor switch your focus. So he says, I will bless you. 
I will bless you, Josiah, with a future filled with hope. So if I came with depression, thank you, Lord. Someone watching online has been suffering from depression. Tell them the Lord has healed them permanently. A future filled, future, future, future filled permanently. Tell them to forget about that thing. What is it called, that thing they do? What is that thing called? That counseling of those people with depression. What is it called? Therapy. The, the word is therapeutic. I'm telling you what I know. He says, a future filled with hope. A future of success. Not of suffering. So already God begins now to analyze. And he begins to say, when you think of your future, you have prayer lives. You think of the future of your prayer life. He tells you, you know, you know the, the reason people struggle with the things of God is we, we box God. When God says, I'm blessing you with a future, I don't just want you to think about your office. Think about your prayer life. Think about if you are like Joshua who loves miracles. Think about working of miracles. Now he tells me, concerning miracles, your future has hope. Then he says, that future is filled with success. Yes. So what is he telling me? When you pray for the blind, they will see. This is what God is saying here, sir. Concerning your worship, your future as a worshiper, as a psalmist, sir, your future is a successful one. It is filled with hope. When you think of yourself in that office, if you're planning to resign, don't resign. God is addressing situations here. He is saying, I am blessing you with a future. A future that is filled with hope. He says, a future of success. A future not of suffering. So as early as now God is addressing our finances, he is saying, in the area of our finances, we will be successes. All right, no more suffering. That's what he is saying now. Verse number 12, verse 13, then I switch to message. Verse 12, he says, you will turn back to me, oh boy, and you will ask for help, like we are doing this morning. Then he says, and what will happen? No, no, no. I want you to see the order. You, you turn back to him. You, you ask. Ah. Uh, he does not help those who don't ask. He says, you turn. I told you, gifts are not received just like those you are in another. No, 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 no. You have to ask. You have to say, Lord, I am tired. I am tired. I am tired. I'm saying, Lord, I am tired. I am tired that I cannot memorize two verses. I am tired that I cannot pray for ten minutes. I am tired. I am tired. I need to see Christ. Why is the God that rose? If he rose, we need to see him. Are you getting it, sir? So he says, now, you will, you will, you will turn back to me. So who turns? Me. Who asks for help? Me. Then you leave it to him. He says, this is what I will do. You know, you can pray, you're knowing the answer. Oh, I missed you. There is no waiting here, saints. And there is no saying no. If the heart has turned back to him, I am telling you, when these gifts begin to move here, there is no room of saying they will come next week. Ah, ay, ay. Brothers and sisters, hear me. You see, for example, this is good coming from Josiah. As of deep, deep, deep revelations, when we lack miracles, they say we are auditors. So God makes sure we must walk in it. So that when we speak revelations, there is proofs. So he says, you will turn back to me. So you may have said, maybe that gift is not mine. God is saying, turn back. Tell your neighbor, turn back. <laughs> uh, you know, there, there has to be that turning back. Then after turning back, sir, don't turn back and be quiet. Open your mouth and ask. Then he says, and ask for help. It's called grace. Then after asking for help, I will answer your prayers. I love this one. I love this one. I love this one. So when I tell you in the next minute, pray. Please pray like your life depends on it. Because your life depends on it. I will answer your prayers. Go to the next verse. The next verse is what? Kabela. Makwabele kai. Ya He says you will worship with what? What will happen? Do you see how sweet that verse can get? You will worship me with all your heart. 
I will be there. Oh, watch the pass. Maybe I should start by praying for them. Like, imagine. Imagine. Let me help you get it, what you are saying. Sing me a song. What do you want to sing me? Let's start demonstrating something with them. Saint, I remove these shoes. Then help me with whatever. We are on air? It's all right. They have shoes. Comforter, make my life comfortable. Teacher, teach me all I need to know. My God, guide me into your way. Comforter, make my life comfortable. Teacher, teach me all I need to know. My God, guide me into your way. Of God, I need your touch in my life, Holy Ghost. Yeah, you are the ancient of days. I need your touch in my life, Holy Ghost. You are the Spirit of God. I need your touch in my life, Holy Ghost. You are the ancient of We are done, we are finished, we are good, so thank you for staying tuned. And remember to like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment below. To Maliza our function, we had a Kesha, church Kesha, and it was amazing. I have been blessed, I hope you have been blessed as well. So, to NFNP next time, uh, don't forget to uh, like, share, subscribe, leave a comment below, press the or click the notification button for immediate updates. Uh, once we upload uh, the any 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 new videos on our channel, and uh, welcome to Meadows Diaries in Meadows Studios. So till we meet next time. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Kama kawaida, remember guys, I love you so 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 much. Till next time. So yes, adios, bye.